Hello, everyone. Welcome to Mindset of an Entrepreneur. I'm your host, Toyin Yumestiri. Today, we're going to be talking about value creation. Your number one job as an entrepreneur is to create value, is to invest your time, energy, and resources to create maximum value. So why do you want to create value? The reason is because the transaction, as I've shared on previous episodes, is about value exchange. We create value and we act for value in return in the form of money. Here's what you also need to realize that before the global economy was formed around money, before money existed, humans engage in trade and batter, right? Trade the exchange of what you have with what I want, right? What you have with what I have. You want what I have and I want what you have, right? That's the trade. And batter is the conversation we would, typ we would typically have to agree on the terms of the exchange, okay? So the world e existed, the world engaged in trade and batter what I have for what you have, and the conversation in terms of what is the value. But here's what then happened. Butter went away and was replaced with money as an intermediary form of exchange that those who want to do business with one another can now do business trade, my value for your value. But instead of butter trying to agree on the terms, we can now use money, and the value of money is determined by the government, right? So $100 is $100, but as an entrepreneur, you still have the control to price. Now we want to price our value, okay? No longer are we going to batter. The strategy now is your pricing strategy. So one of the strategy you want to use as an entrepreneur, if you understand what I just shared, is increasing your value, will influence the value you can get, the money you can get from the marketplace, okay? Because now we measure value in terms of money. Now, economies, the marketplace measured value, right? The economic value is the monetary terms. So when it's time for you to build your business as you're trying to expand your business, one of the ways to expand your business is increasing the perceived value of your products and services, and also making sure you understand the mindset of the people you want to trade with, okay? Because they have to agree. Before a transaction happens, a transaction is an agreement that this value is what it is to you, and it is what it is to me. In my mind, your value and your pricing, I am agreeing that that value is valuable to me. So are you following me? Okay. So as an entrepreneur, we're living in a time where value even has been disrupted. The marketplace has been disrupted and what people now value, what's in the past they may be willing to pay for has moved into the era of free. They can now freely access those things. What do you do then as an entrepreneur is you step up your value game. One of the ways to win in this economy and what's coming is you don't reduce value, you actually step up value. You offer more value, right? So you would find out that a lot of businesses are struggling today because what they used to offer, say five years ago, that was perceived within the lens of a particular value Today, if you attempt to offer the same thing, it is now a commodity. It's now readily available. It's no longer a premium. It's no longer perceived as a premium because it's now easily accessible, maybe at a lower value somewhere else. So your job right now, your strategy is to step up your value, to add on value, okay? The marketplace, the customers, the clients, they're asking for more greater value. So one of the strategies I want you to increase right now, one of the strategies I want you to implement right now is to go back to your drawing board and ask yourself this question. How can I improve the value of my product and my services? 
Thank you so much for joining me today for Mindsets of an Entrepreneur. I look forward to seeing you again next week. Bye.